bowls. Scoop pray and they jowls. Bones the first day in the gullet, he goes to the bowels. All right, children. Welcome, welcome to uh, the ever famous David and Herman's seventh grade science show. Today is a very special time you've all been looking forward to. We're going to dissect the owl pellet. You have a diagram, yet what you discover in the pellet doesn't match the diagram. Go online, find a different diagram. It could be any one of different size birds, different kinds of birds, different kinds of rats, moles, anything. All right? So, um... <laughs> I can't believe somebody actually wrote a song about this. Owl pellets. I think you're going to find this one song you're going to fall in love with. This one in the cell, organelles and cells. This is cool. So I would suggest you play this in, play this in the background as you're doing your owl pellet things. Okay? All right, let's go. Start it up. So, Dave has an owl pellet. Remember that the owl pellet is not the poop of the owl. It is a vomit. Owls don't chew their food, they simply swallow it whole. One stomach digests the, the soft tissue, and then every night an owl will sit quietly and he'll throw up a pellet of bones and hair. And you can, from that, you tell what the owl ate that day. All right? So, Dave, you have an owl pellet in front of you. So, Dave's going to enjoy turning this thing apart. I was excited about this one. <laughs> I love owls, and this is really fascinating to me. So, we'll play in the background the owl pellet song. So, Dave is pulling the, the foil away. He's wearing gloves. The pellet that Dave is using is not sterilized. The pellet you have has been sterilized. Uh, Dave, show us the tools we've supplied for them. Tweezers. Toothpicks. Yeah. And a nail. Some of you will have a two big nails. Some will have a little nail and a screw. They're just sharp things that allow you to pull the pellet apart. Okay, Dave, dive in. I can already see the tail of one of this. Okay, so, so pull it apart. Really cool. You have to you use both to hands, Dave. Open it. Let's go. Dig in there. And it's uh, very hairy. No ketchup, no mustard, please. Oh, boy. I think I see a nose, too, actually. Oh. How close can I get to this? I'm going to move the camera in a bit. Okay. A lot I don't want to miss a bone. All right, there we go. I can see like this, like a profile of a face and a nose. I definitely can see a tail right there. Like, oh, I see oh, a I, foot. That's gross. <laughs> Dave, you're enjoying this. This is really gross. Too. There's a foot. There's a foot. So this owl didn't digest everything too well, did he? And I place on the uh, paper what I got here. I see yeah. a foot and a... All right. Is it lunchtime yet? This is like a buffalo wild weed right here. There you go. Yeah, Dave's getting hungry, so we better hurry along here. <laughs> I was. This is really weird. <laughs> Well, we don't have smell of vision here. It's not that good. What do you think? That, oh, this is more like a like a like a leg joint. I would say this bone broke. That could be here too. Yeah, either one. It could be. So take all the fur off of it. What you think? Here? Yeah, it looks good. Here? Looks good. Part of it. Wow, this owl didn't digest his food too well. I see a lot of, I see some red meat there. <laughs> I don't want to break, yeah. Sorry, Dave. I don't want to break this one up, but that's cool right here. So you don't have to use gloves that's because cool. the pellet we bought for you comes from a company that sterilizes it. Oh boy. Dave got an owl pellet out of my backyard. Uh -oh. So, in Hemet and San Jacinto, you have owls. If you have an owl in your neighborhood, go stand or walk around the base of that tree, and you might just see a little glob of hair and bones. That's an owl pellet. But it hasn't been sterilized. 
very I good. Think they yeah. really count on this thing. <laughs> it's like uh, the operation game we used to have in the Lions Den. I'm getting grossed out. Uh, yeah, there's tissue on this one. Oh, man. There definitely is tissue. Oh boy, Mr. Hilke, I don't know. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> what do you think, here? Yeah. I don't know. It looks like a short bone. I wonder if it broke its bone, because that's a pretty long bone there. Yeah. I'm not sure about cool. this one. Look at that tail. Got it. This is a foot. A foot. So. All right. I believe that's a foot. Okay. So have it's you identified, got little nails did you get a skull? It. I don't see a skull in this one. No. So some of you may get a skull. There have been times where you get more than one skull. If this owl's eating little birds, you'll see the little bird skull. What's that round white thing? It's part of the bone. Ooh, that's cool. It's a joint. It's like a ball joint. Yeah, it is. So that would be on leg. Is this or it could be up a here rat? In the arm? A mouse or a rat? That look. That look is a look that can only happen by a roaring Oof. fire at a verbal cabin. Yeah. After eating. These are part of the broken pieces. I think. I'm gonna have this song in my head all day, Mr. Hilke. Yeah, me too. <laughs> all right. What do you think, more vertebrae here? Yeah. So, uh, oh. kids, there's one thing that always upsets Mr. Hilke. If you don't take the time and rub the fur, you'll find itty bitty bones. I need there. you to rub the fur and find the itty bitty bones. You're not finished until you rub the fur and find the itty bitty bones. Dave, are you finding the itty bitty bones? I sure am. There's one here. Oh, I cool. got one here. It's hard to tell what I would say these are vertebrae. Or, right? Okay. So Somewhere? you should have an idea now how amazing owls are. They see in total darkness. They're, yeah. they're stealth. You won't hear an owl flying. Like the other birds you can hear flying. And owls uh, have no natural enemies except for man and cars and hawks. Hawks love to eat owls. Really? Yeah. Sorry, owl. That's too bad. Need more time? Have you watched you enough? That's good. Okay, so that's going to wrap it up. Uh, I'm going to move the camera back now. You get a sense? I need you to rub all the little yucky stuff, the little things, out of it. And, okay, Dave. Was that I think fun? I that was a bowl because I could see its nose. Yeah. Face. Fascinating. <laughs> Very fascinating. I like all right. this, guys. You like this? Yes. All right. Was it worth it? Yes. All right. So that wraps it. That's a, that's a take. And then um, um, I need you to take a picture of your mess. What you found, and if you can, tell me what kind of animal was that this owl ate that day. You can tell what the animal, what the owl ate, and then if all of us turn in what the owl ate, we'll have a sense of these 30 owls or these 40 owls ate in one day. Okay? So we'll compare our notes and we'll add up all the different types of animals these owls ate. Okay? So. Take a picture of what you found, use some glue, some simple little glue, and glue it to, glue it to the paper. So Dave, here's some glue. Any kind of, and don't use a lot, just a little touch of the glue. 
glue it on, and you'll have a treasure you can have for the rest of your life. Okay? We through? Awesome. That's a wrap. Thank you.